Listening Library presents A Light in the Darkness, Janusz Korczak, His Orphans and the Holocaust, by Albert Marin. Read for you by Stefan Rudnitsky. For the innocents, may they never be forgotten. May a better world grow out of their suffering. I wanted to discuss the suffering of humanity in general, but perhaps we'd better confine ourselves to the sufferings of children. Fyodor Dostoevsky, The Brothers Karamazov, 1880 Prologue The Two Saddest Nations on Earth Gone now are those little towns where the wind joined biblical songs with Polish tunes and Slavic rule where old Jews in orchards in the shade of cherry trees lamented for the holy walls of Jerusalem. Gone now are those little towns, though the poetic mists, the moons, winds, ponds, and stars above them have recorded in the blood of centuries the tragic tales, the histories of the two saddest nations on earth. Antoni Swanimsky, Elegy for the Little Jewish Towns, 1947 if you want to visit that place from Warsaw, the capital of Poland, it is best to go by automobile. You can drive yourself or hire a car and a guide for about $80. With a little luck, the 60-mile trip should take just over two hours. Upon leaving Warsaw, located on both sides of the Vistula River, head northeast on the highway that parallels the warsaw Białystok Railroad, which goes to the Russian border. About two miles after crossing a bridge over the river Bug, you must turn right at the village of Maukinia Junction. Here the road follows a branch line linking to the main rail line from the southeast. You are almost there. Another three and a half miles brings you to a quiet village.